whatnot, let's head in GameStop. They got some kind of sale going on right now, McFarlane's and whatnot. So let's go see what they got. All right, let's hit the gut here. We got an unpunched Ghost Rider. Good price on him. We've got Titans, Beast Boy, and Raven. Black as night. What Batman is that? Dark Knight Batman. Dark Knight Trilogy Batman, that is. Mr. Freeze. I'm still got this barbecue. That's the beat up on the head. Let's see here. We've got the Flash statue. Man Bat. What is this? Bloodhound. What is that? Uh, we got some new legends. Water Supreme. Strucker. Ah, Wonder Man. everybody beginning yet another wonderful week of toy hunting let's run in walmart here check out what they got all right let's see what we got this morning yeah, i got some new like, beast alliance or something the big optimus primal thing there it's pretty cool so it's, looks like some new transformers Leo, Donnie, Graf, and Leo. I'm going to get Nike on storage show. Some more up there. Dinos. Got a mixed strike there. Sam Wilson, Captain America Shield. Nerf launcher thing. Still got the same older multiverse up there. Down our video games behind us. Let's go ahead and check. I got a bunch of Pokemon cards up down there. Some more Luke Turner boxes. Pikachu up there. Oh, there's a bunch of them actually. And what do we got down through here? Alright. And we got some legends. Another John Kent up there. There's Awkward Man. Uh, let's see what we got. Oh, Martian Manhunter, John Kent, Demon. All right, we're back. They are actually stocking the toys right now, so I had to check out for a second. I don't remember seeing that before. And of course, you know, it's more expensive than the others. It's pretty cool looking moon knight. Uh, let's see what it's going to tell me. Beware. I got the flash down there. And oh, I don't have one, but right there, the flash Batmobile. It's gonna be the Spin Master 89 whenever that baby comes in. So at least they got a spot on the shelf for it. Makes me think they may get it. Maybe their stocking will get it today. It's a Star Wars. And then Still movie G.I. Joe's, movie G.I. Joe's, movie G.I. Joe's. Uh, hey, we have had a G.I. Joe restock. There's Gung Ho. Somebody got a case of him in. It's the first new of those I've seen here in quite a while. There's a Snake Eyes coming out, I think in May or June. Retro card that we'll be looking for. What we got up there? Death Storm. Uh, same ones, multiverse. All right, that's gonna be it for this. Uh, let's go check out some die casts and then see if we can pick at some of the stock boxes they got down there. Find anything I'll film. If not, see you at the next. 
All right, we've got a ton of these Lucid Air cars. Look at this. A bunch of them. Let's see if we've got any Batman. Not seeing any. We have got some Hot Wheels in, but I don't recall seeing this. Lucid Air. There's also a bunch of stock boxes down there. It might have to be like last Monday. I had to leave and then come back. Is that a Batmobile color shifter? Oh, that's a good looking 89 Batmobile. Let's just hang on to that one. Uh, what else we got here? Got any more of those in color shifter? I don't think I've seen that before. I wonder what it does. And I've seen these, but I never messed with them. So it gets flames on it and get it wet. Anyway, that's a cool looking 89 Batmobile here, regardless of what it does. Uh, let's see. I got a bunch of monster trucks. Can't really get to. I don't see anything new, looks like, in the Batman cars we should look at. So let's go and do it for this hour. Let's go check out. Let's see what we got back here. NASCAR Yellowstone Sheriff's car. All right, let's go do it for here. Let's go check collectors. Collector section got our two packs, some turtles, Michelangelo mummies, an actual mummy. Uh, you got the black and white Batman and Catwoman. And there's a black Adam back there, the black and white variant. We got some different stuff here this morning. They stocked a little bit. A couple of Star Wars figures back in this section. Uh, what else we got? Jeremy Jam, Parks and Recreation. Still no Flash movie pops yet. There's a Jeff Hardy Ultimate hanging out right there. Somebody, I don't know if they tried to hide it or just thought it was the same figure series. Maybe not knowing what it was, but been back here for a while. Also got a Black Manta and a couple of Green Arrows. And then you can see over there, got nothing new over there. Same old, same old. So I think that's going to wrap us up. We're going to head back to this Walmart a little bit later today because they are stocking quite heavily. And just see if maybe in some of those boxes they have the Spin Master Batmobile. But until then, I will see everyone later. Alrighty, let's run in Target and let's see if they got anything new. They had some tags up last time I was in here for the new Flash movie stuff from Spin Master. So let's go see if they got anything. Alrighty, here we are. Got a bunch of Pokemon out there. We'll take a look, see what they got there in a second. But we have got Impulse. And long story short, I came by here yesterday. One of these I got when you saw me at Johnson City was cracked and broke right here on the side. So I stopped here yesterday and filmed and did pick up one of these, but that was the only thing yesterday they had. So long story short, I'm not going to put that footage on. But I did pick up a new impulse yesterday and now I gotta bring my other one back in here to return it. What else we got? Oh, they got the bat cycle. And then bat flag there on Spin Master, 21 bucks. Ooh. Probably wanna pick that up, guys. Hoping for some G.I. Joe Crimson Guards or Crimson Bat. But I am not seeing the Crimson Bat. The Batwing, I'm not sure if they had those back in stock last time. And they got these Flash boot goblet things. And then we've got Dark Flash, Keaton, and two Flash figs there. Jay Garrick, but a non-platinum. And then Clearance Shazam. I bet Shazam is still there. By the time I get done looking, we're probably going to scan him. Okay, they still got the three Project Superman. I'm hoping to get this guy on clearance, but I do want to get that. And then the Flash I saw was announced to be coming next. I think the Flash will have two different editions, one with the mask and another go variant without the, without the mask. Let's see, we got, don't see any Spider-Man, Spider-Verse. Let's check this end cap down here. We'll check the other side of this. Let's just check the front of these now. Miles Morales stuff's pretty cool looking. 
that little character set there. That's pretty cool. $59.99 for that. They got a spot down there where those Gujitsus are for the Spider-Verse figs, but they're not there. And here's all of our Pokemon stuff. Some Mega Blocks, some Pops, ton of Pokemon. But anywho, that's kind of cool. Fortnite the Baller. Oh, look at that. That is awesome. What is that? Master Grade Series Omega Knight. You know, twenty two ninety nine. dollars I wonder what it comes with. That's actually pretty cool. If that were a Marvel or something else, that'd be 60 bucks. There's some Mario Kart there. One big Mario and Luigi and Yoshi down there. Movie figures. Sonic. And then our Pokemon down here. Okay. And what we got in Legends, we still got two Extremis Iron Man, and then the White Panther. We're going to scan that Shazam down there. Let's see if he's dropped in more clearance. I see the end cap up there for the WWE Elite Series 100, but I don't see any figures. So I'm wondering if I'm getting ready to see them on the back side of this aisle. <laughs> There's an Extremis Iron Man here with the Guardians. Still got two Groots. Again, that Groot I'm probably going to pick up. Hopefully on clearance one of these days. Another Iron Man there. We got Rocket. Mantis, Drax, Star-Lord. Warlock. Doesn't look like they have. Um, what am I looking for? Kraglin or... Oh, I can see your face. The blue chick. Gamora sister. Nebula. Oh. Ooh, look. Boxes. What have we got here in the wrestling? Yep, here's the Series 100. We got Cena, Becky Lynch, Mon, and Karrion Cross, and then The Rock in that series. Still got AJ Styles, the Rey Mysterio in that series, the WCW Cruiserweight title. It's just awesome. Still got our Dark Trooper. Got the Gamorrean Guard. Lando on Biker Scout. Let's see. They have sold. They had one more man at arms yesterday. It's gone now. We got Andra. All those are Andras. They're too bad. Wally. 93 Jurassic Park. That Jeep set down there with Ellie and the Raptors, pretty cool. Then on sale, some of this stuff I've marked down a little bit. All right, let's check out some die cast. Big bin of Hot Wheels and stuff here. Let's see what they got. They got the little Batmobile there. I did pick up another one of those. Can't remember if that was on camera or not. But the one I originally picked up, I didn't realize. The card was messed up. And, you know, I like the cars to be pretty. Mercedes Benz is nice. Bone shaker. And Batman Forever, that's a cool Hot Wheel too. I got a couple of those. I'll open one of those up eventually whenever I get my man cave done. Got a doctor's appointment today and I think Kelly and I are going to look at some more of those buildings. The man collects men cave going on. Okay, what else we got down through here? Moving kind of quick, guys. Not seeing anything else really different. Right, let's walk up and check out the Lego. Got some poly bags here. Doctor Strange and the Speed Champion I picked up. There's a Harry Potter and an X-Wing. I enjoy the little poly bag sets. 
I said it gives me something to do in my lunch break sometimes if I don't go out anywhere. Looks pretty stock. I don't know if I've got any new sets or not. I would like to have that eventually. I've missed it on sale a couple of times. They got the space shuttle back in. That's one of the best sets I've ever built. Just to be honest. There's the typewriter. I've got the pyramid, never built it. I've got that Fast and the Furious. I didn't care much for it. Botanicals. Kelly's got all of those, except for the Birds of Paradise. She didn't want that one. And Dom's Charger. That Ferrari's pretty cool looking too. And our Mega Blocks. I like that halo set there. And let's take a look down here at the end. Got the Millennium Falcon again. Tie Bomber, Mandalorian, Starfighter. Now these might be new. I don't remember seeing some of these Star Wars sets. Boba Fett, Fett Stone Room, the ATST. You Star Wars people, let me know. Are these new? They just. I haven't noticed them before. And out here on the end, we got the GT. Some more botanicals. I'm telling you, if this wasn't 60 bucks, this set of Spider-Verse figures here is really tempting. Mostly because of the Prowler. But I think that is going to do it for the main toy aisle. I'm going to get Shazam there and scan him and see what he is. And then I will see you in collectibles. Alright, we scan Shazam. Still going at $19. Sure, $16 on the ticker sticker. So I'm sure they would honor that. But nah, I think I'll wait for it to hit nine. Alright, let's see what we got here. Predators, Pan's Labyrinth, King Kong. Not seeing anything different back in there. So got that cool it Mego figure there. Um, let's see. What we got down through here, got some pops, Jurassic World, ooh. There's the pop of Batflick. That's pretty cool. I wonder if they have uh, Ant-Man, Rocket. Let's move this Gremlin back over here. What do we got in here? There's the Flash. Um, New kids on the block. Jurassic Park. Is this the one where he has the bat? Yeah. <laughs> um, the only one of these. Is that from the Flash movie? Yep, General Zod. And then they got Dark Flash back in there. And there's that Barry Allen. But no 89 Batman. If somebody hears this and knows, please correct me and let me know. But I'm thinking I heard somewhere the 89 Batman pop for that is going to be Walmart exclusive. I'm not for sure. I've not seen those pops at Walmart yet. Target's the only place I've seen any of them. So I don't know. Some Demon Slayer anime. They got the radioactive Batman. They got the spot. I don't see the spot yet for Two Face, but they got several. King Tut, there's Two Face. On the radioactive. So the radioactive is actually supposed to be right here. So, you're welcome, Target. Red Hood, Scarecrow, and Green Arrow. Still got those same reactions, it's been here forever, and the same best action has been here forever. I actually sold a couple of those. Bunch of those two packs there. Ooh, we got a G.I. Joe here. Falcon. I would like to find the Crimson Bat. But anyways, guys, I think that's going to do it for Target. We're going to check Walmart to see if they got their stuff stocked. They were stocking heavily when I was in there earlier today. If I see anything new in there, I will film it. If not, I will see you at the next. Tidy waddies. All right, time for the haul portion. This video, you see me in, let's see, GameStop, Walmart, and Target all in bristol virginia but you're probably seeing something here in front of me that you know i didn't pick up from any of those stores so i have got quite an online haul laid out here in front of me at my good old trusty standing desk 
And we're gonna take a look at that first and try to clear some room off here so I can actually show everything that I've, that I've got lately. But the first thing we're gonna look at before I go into what this is, and anyone who knows the 89 Batmobile and the older toys know what it is, but this is an eBay purchase. I picked up the 89 Batmobile. Um, I usually I don't go for the box on these things, but this one I found the car and I'll show you why I liked it, but it did come with the box. And as you can see, the box is in really good condition. This thing on eBay, one of the reasons I wanted it, you know, for one, they didn't put the stickers on the side of it. I don't understand why that came with this. There was no stickers on the actual car, but I can get, I guess, for playability, but those are still sealed in plastic. Got the missiles and the stickers and the instructions. And then this thing, what I call the clamshell. I mean, look at this, no brakes. It is in perfect shape. And I did pay a little bit more for this Batmobile than what normally sells for on eBay. But one of the reasons was because this thing. And I had this. I've actually got this car that I got when I was a kid. Mine's beat all the crap. I'll talk about that in a minute. But I didn't know what this was. I threw it away thinking it was just like a clamshell the car came in. So anyways, it's cool to have that. And then we have the car. And look at this. You can tell this is new. It's barely got any kind of scuffs or anything on it. That got on my nerves when I was a kid as far as that goes. But, you know, the launchers. The launchers work there for the missile things. It's great shape. Love the car. But, uh, again, mine, <laughs> one I still got. I still got the missiles for it. But I broke, I think, this one of the bat wings. I broke off of it. And I used a hot glue gun. It's, it, I was, like, probably nine years old at the time. So, of course, I didn't do a very clean job in fixing it. But... Again, I wanted a toy, the toy Batmobile from each of the, the the four films in the animated series. So I did pick this one up. All right, that is one eBay purchase we're going to look at in this video. And let's move this guy. Bear with me as you get a close up of the desk. The next eBay, the last eBay purchase I got, I picked up the. I don't know how to pronounce that, so I'm going to put it there. Version of Batman. I think this was Target exclusive. I tried to order the two-pack of these off of McFarland Toy Store that came with this one and the McFarland Toy exclusive Unmasked that were out of this one. So they're going to send me the Unmasked one at a reduced cost. So I still wanted this one to go with it, so I got on eBay and found him, and it came in. It's got a little bit of a bend there to the hanger, but not much, but otherwise in really good shape. We picked up the Batman of Zer N R off of eBay as well as the 89 Batmobile. Okay, what's next? Next will be Target. I got a pre-order in from Target, something I was very excited to get. We got the Poe statue of the Keaton Batman from the new Flash movie, and check that thing out. That is awesome. But it came in, again, I probably won't open this, it'll probably stay in box. So if I ever do want to open one where it is where I am partial and nostalgic to the Keaton Batman, I'll probably get another one to open it. But this will be staying in box. I'm trying to look at the face sculpt there. He's actually turning his head a little bit. People said he couldn't turn his head in costume. <laughs> but we got that in from Target. Okay, what's next? Next we'll do Amazon. We're gonna start with one thing that I got in last week that I didn't I didn't get in in time to show on a video the day this was been delivered, but I've already taken it out of the box, but we got the Batman Batmobile, the Spin Master. This is the one, I don't think I've got it turned on, but it lights up and makes all the sounds. Let's see. Is that the two setting or the one? Uh, I can't tell what it's on. Uh, that's the one, okay. But you know, it's got the little tail on the back and makes the sound. Pretty sweet there. This thing's awesome. I gotta turn it off, it's way too loud. There we go. The thing is sweet. The door is open on this thing. I mean, it's good, good detailing, good skill. I waited on this thing forever thinking it would go on clearance at Walmart since many of them are still sitting on the shelves. It never did. It's $32, $33 in Walmart. Amazon had this thing. I think it was $23 and I got it, got it shipped in. As you can see, I've already got it out of the box and Batman's already driving. We did pick up the Batman Batmobile. Okay, some other Amazon purchases. This is another one I've looked at at Walmart before, the RC version of a Spin Master Batmobile. They had this thing for like $10 cheaper. I think it was $19 on Amazon. So I ordered it. Um, like I said, do I need this thing? No, I just wanted it. It was at a good price, so I ordered the thing. I will be taking this off card and, 
and messing with it here so we'll see how good it controls and how good this thing is um my stepson luke has got the big batmobile the all-terrain version of this the rc that thing's awesome i can't believe how durable that has actually been and held up to him so but that one has the same kind of luck with the last of my amazon purchases I'm trying to move this stuff around here oops I got this version of the Batmobile as well. I just got this in today, so I haven't got it. I haven't gotten out of the box yet. It's the same car, but it's the dirty variant. And of course, I did not know this existed until I saw it on Amazon. But you know, I've got the other version of the Batmobile, so I wanted this one to go with it. It did come with a dirtier version of Batman, I guess, though. I got mud on their pants and boots there, but. I did want this version of Batmobile as well. I haven't taken it out of the box yet. I think it's the exact same thing. It just has, you know, the mud here on the side of the car. But again, I will be taking, I've already opened it up. I will be taking this out of the box and comparing it to the other one. But I'm sure it's the same car. All right, so you guys wait on me to do that. We'll just set that up here. And we'll go into my retail pickups. So you saw on my weekend hunt, I picked up Impulse at Johnson City Target. But what I didn't notice, it was broken the case right in through here luckily bristol had one so i did pick up another impulse at bristol to get one with a perfect box i took the other one back i was afraid i might have messed it up and one thing about doing these videos that was good i was able to go back and see it was broken even in the store when i first picked it up so and we did get another impulse to replace the one that that was damaged the next thing i picked up you can probably figure out from target i did pick up the bat flick bat cycle from the flash movie and look at the black bat flake figure. I mean, I agree with people were saying it's kind of hard to see. It's so small, but he nailed the face sculpt better for Ben Affleck than McFarlane did in the small scale. But we got the bat cycle there. You know, it's got the two wheel design on the front. Still looking for 89 Batmobile. I've got a lead on that thing. Hopefully, I'll be adding it to the collection soon. But we picked this up. Don't know yet if I'm going to take this off the card or leave it. But I did want this because, you know, I got everything Keaton Batman. You know, Batflex, my second favorite Batman. So definitely wanted that and let's see last but not least in walmart the other morning i did pick up the color shifter batmobile hot wheel this is all i got in walmart they didn't have anything else really new that morning but again i'm a sucker for 89 batmobile i did not have this one it looks like it's got some flame effect or something there that comes on when you get it wet i'll, I'll leave these on car unless i buy more than one so this won't be coming off the car to check it out, but I did. I, I know I always complain about chrome wheels on this, but the silver looks better than the gold in my opinion. But again, it's a cool looking Batmobile, another version of the 89, so we did pick that up. But let me look around my table here. As you can see, that is all my loot. You can see I got st stuff laying everywhere here, but we got all this, the 89 Batmobiles hanging out down there on the floor, but I appreciate you guys watching and don't forget check me out on instagram i am on there now getting some followers having some fun with instagram that's kind of like that's a way to get stuff out quicker you know, i'm out hunting and i don't always record i'm in stores but i got a way to take a quick photo to show what i'm finding so appreciate the support on there don't forget to follow me if you're already not and as usual if you're a first time viewer to this content or the returning viewer who has yet to subscribe consider hitting subscribe otherwise guys i will see you later and thanks for watching